Hello class, this will be your virtual tutorial on how to use the pH meter. First, you need to assemble all the equipment and materials including the reagents that you will be using. Next is to uncap your electrode. Then, wash it with distilled water. Wipe the electrode very carefully, including the temperature rod. After, you can then proceed reading your solution. Here, we will be starting off with the basic solution. Also, important to note that you should be using a pH meter that is already calibrated. Next is to descend the electrodes, allowing the bulb to be submerged under the solution. Wait for the pH meter to read the solution until the number is stabilized. Once the pH meter has stabilized its reading, you can then record the indicated pH. Then, ascend back the electrode for you to be able to wash it. Submerge it first in a distilled water for a couple of seconds. Then, rinse it well with another distilled water to completely wash off any residual solution. Then, carefully wipe off the electrode, including the temperature rod. After washing, you can then proceed with your next solution. This time, we are reading the acidic solution. The same as earlier, descend the electrode allowing the bulb to be submerged under the solution. Wait for the pH meter again to stabilize its reading. Record the reading, then ascend back the electrode. Submerge the bulb again under distilled water to remove any residual solution. Then, rinse it again with another distilled water. It is very important to wash your electrode, including your temperature rod, every after solution, so to prevent any inaccurate reading.
always be careful in handling the bulb since this is very sensitive. Once you have finished reading all your solutions, recap your electrode bulb. Thank you for watching.